everybody, my name is Spamwolves and welcome back to Sort the Court. In the previous episode, we began our reign as King Spamwolves, taking questions from the peasants from town. We made some gold, made friends with a dragon, uh, but we're still quite a ways from having a fine city. I've since learnt that the game ends when we get 250 citizens, so that's the goal without any more stalling. Let's begin! We're doing money, money, money! Wow, actually we're 214 citizens, we're doing pretty good. Do you find me humorous? Oh, la, 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 la. You crazy bastard, get out. The circus is packed up in another town, but not we're leaving behind some gold. Thank you. I think we're about to win. Could I trouble you for a sound? Give the guy a sandwich, for God's sake. Who's next? Oh, my advisor. There's a very stinky kid running around the streets. Should we force her to have a bath? Yes, mate. Glad you agree. She won't be happy, though. Fuck you and your happiness. Be clean. <clears throat> you call this a castle? Yes. We've had this... Indeed it is! Trick question! We've had this talk before. Has the game run out of questions? There's a mouse! Should we chase it away? No! It's got an equal book! That's adorable! <laughs> Squeak! It seems happy. Ah, uh, goodbye, mousey. Day 13 complete! People are happy. The city is growing. The city's population is growing steadily. Our records of citizenship indicate that 250 people now call the city home. With a bigger city, we we'll need to maintain even higher happiness in order to keep people satisfied. Make sure you pay attention to the citizens and their issues to raise their happiness. Anyway, we still have lots of work to do. Let's make the city even bigger. By the way, remember earlier when we mentioned the Council of Crowns? I've heard a rumor that one of their members has been searching the land for a new ruler to join them. <coughs> Perhaps they are aware of our progress. Goodbye, assistant. I guess I was wrong saying we need the 250 citizens. I guess we just need to get onto the Council of the High Crowns. The Sultan returns an offer for you, my friend. I would purchase a shipment of luxury goods from you for a fair price. Okay. Money is... Why is that negative happiness? I don't care. Look how much gold we got. Oh, that fucking eyeball. It's just staring at me. Does it want something? No, it doesn't. Last time it robbed us, the bastard! No! I feel happy! We got 10 happiness! Yes, mate! Winston! Hey, uh, you think you could tell people to stop calling me Slimeball? It's hurting my feelings! Is it, mate? Okay. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Thanks, boss! Goodbye, Slimeball! Oh, it's the guy! He's making us an anti-dragon weapon! My sales have brought in record profits, and I'd like to give you something as a thanks. Will you accept my gift? We had a gentleman's agreement that I would be reconciled with some monetary gain for allowing him to set up shop within my fair city. But would it make it him happy if I said no? But no, it would it'd be insulting to not accept a gift. Yes, my blacksmith friend! Gift me! Very good, very good. Oh, 40 gold. Is that all you got? Well, I, I thanks. Ciao. End of the day. Happiness is at an all-time high. And my wealth is something. It's the cat called Boots. Meow, motherfucker, meow. Meow back at him. Meow, mate. That's a happy kitty cat. Goodbye, Boots. Here's the flower girl. Some nasty bugs have made a home out of our garden. Can we have some gold to hire an exterminator? Sure you can. Have some of this gold. City's not growing. Is the castle in the background going to hurry up and build grandma? Oh, dear. I read quite the troubling tale in the paper today. Think everything will be all right. Yes, Gran. Stop being a douche. I hope you are right, my son. <laughs> One more leave. Oh, the little mouse is back. Hi. He's offering me something. Okay. He found a coin. That's the best mouse you could ever hope to find. Goodbye, little one. Oh, I'm going to leave the kingdom now to pursue my dream of becoming a, ga a game dev. Goodbye. No, I saved you. I can destroy you. Well, you can't really stop me, so bye. The hell? You just threw a gold cog at me? Take this cog to remember me by. I got plenty, so you can have this one. Oh, mate. Is it gold? What the fuck? Mortimer. Um, yes, hello. One of your fishermen has been bothering me. I demand a villager a, um, a sacrifice. Yes. What the fuck are you doing here? Get the fuck out of my throne room, you freaking monster boo from the ocean. You're lucky. Oh, you've angered me now, sir. Watch your back. Well, what are you going to do? What are you going to do? That's what I thought. Walk away. We're going to drown in gold. What the fuck? Yano? 
Hello, hello, I'm Yanni of the Comfy Kingdom. You may not believe this, but I am the royal assistant of the kingpin himself. Indeed, the very same. I have been noodling around this kingdom of yours and I, oh wait, what's that over there? Button boy? Good sir, did you happen to see a blue fellow come through here just now? Strange, knobbly limbs, made of yarn. Yes, mate, I did. I knew he was around here somewhere. I'm going to find that darn Yarno. He's been running around claiming to be Kingpin's royal assistant, which of course, he is not. In fact, it is I, Button Boy, who represents the Comfy Kingdom in the esteemed Council of Crowns. Have you heard of the Council of Crowns, good sir? Well, as a matter of fact, I have. Then surely you thought about joining. Perhaps we could work out a bit of a deal. That Yano has been given out nothing but trouble. If you could somehow put a stop to his shenanigans, I might be able to get you a meeting with Pierre, the advisor of the Celestial Kingdom. If anyone would be able to induct your kingdom into the council, it would be her. What do you say? Will you help me catch that darned Yano? Where the fuck is this game going? I don't know you. I don't know Yano. Why would I take allegiances at this point? Do you have any ID? You know, button boy, official aide to the crown. Yes, mate. Because mm -hmm. making people happy is what I do best. Yeah. <laughs> Very good, I'll leave the details up to your discretion. Once Yano is out of the way, I'll set up a meeting with Pierre. Thank you for your assistance in this matter, good sir. I'm sure we'll meet again soon. I'm sure we probably will. Chesty, I'm hungry. Can I eat some folks? I got plenty of gold. I can... This fucking thing wants to eat my people. Chester, I said no to you twice now. Why do you think this time we'll be met with a different answer? No. Mm -mm. Get out. Get out. Peanut! Ook, ook, ook! He's got some shiny coin. Yes, mate? Ook, ook, ook! Thank you, Peanut! You're my favorite monkey doodle! You call this a castle? You're a douche! Mm -hmm. Fuck you and your freaking stupid trick question! The extra food we've been able to store in our grannies has attracted more settlers. Should we let them in? Yes, but wait! I am bored! What the hell is this game doing? Oh, you, Chester, I'm hungry. You know what? I kind of want to let him eat somebody. Because he's such a persistent little chest. Chester, just this, just one time, okay? Nobody can know about this. Just, just get it over with, okay? There you go. Only 100 gold? Cool. I'll just eat a few. Here's your payment. Thanks, dude. See you later. Goodbye. You ever see a treasure chest do a backflip? No? Mm -mm. Well, you're not gonna. Thanks, buddy. Could I trouble you for a sandwich, my lord? Someone as wealthy as you surely could spare a bit of gold for a sandwich. Fuck off and build something, you lazy bastard. I'm bored of this game. It just keeps going and going. Remember the time the dragon came? That was a great time. That was a good time. It threatened everybody. It gave me a glimmer of hope and excitement. That good. Oh, take your fucking sandwich. Piss off. Mm -hmm. Oh, good. Fantastic. You're excited about eating it. Piss off. Been a brawl at the tavern. Of course. Mm -hmm. Why do you freaking ask me these retarded questions? Oh, Vlad, and your fucking balls. Oh, I'm the Duke of Spook. Do you want me to give. Um, yes, give mm -hmm. me a spoopy nickname. I can be the Creepy King. Spammels, the creepy king. Fuck right off. Piss off. Oh, you. Get an original thought. Yes, it's a castle. Indeed. Trick question. Suck a dick. Little Timmy. Hi, I'm little Timmy. Nice to meet you. You like ice cream? Yeah, I do. Mm -hmm. Wow, me too. Thanks for that, Timmy. It's the same mouse from before offering me something, is it? Coins is coins. What a good little mouse. Goodbye, mousy poo. Oh, fuck off, Chester. <laughs> what? No, Chester, you can't eat them. If I tell you, you can't. Come, you fucking dick. Yes, it's a castle, you freaking bastards. I've been recording for an hour and ten minutes now. The time is now. Oh, look, it's, it's ten to one in the morning. I'm done. I legit... I legit tried super hard to get this done today. I thought this would be a great two-part series to do, maybe. But no, wasn't a good idea. I don't know where this ends. 
Doesn't feel like it's anytime soon. I'm freaking bored of it. They ask the same questions over and over. They don't use any initiative. Should we arrest somebody who started a fight? Yes. Can I have a sandwich, my liege? Yes, you can. And that stupid freaking plant lady. The plants not work. Can I get an exterminator again? How many is this? Seven. Get another one and make it the last. And there's this jester bastard who keeps taking all my freaking gold. I've got a thousand gold left. I can't afford your show, jester. This is stupid. It was really fun in the beginning. It was super fun. Now I am just ripping my own eyeballs out because I find it a bit more entertaining. I, I'm not even giving it my full oomph anymore. They say this must be terribly boring for you to watch. I think, I think we're done. Uh, we're done. This is done. Leave me a comment down below if you know something about what's coming up in the future. Like if I, if I keep at it a little bit longer, does something monumental happen? Does, does it just get really amazing? Or is, is this it? For the rest of my life because i don't think i can do it anymore people i don't think i'll make it so on that bombshell wait this is a really shit ending can the dragon please come back you know what hang on just to piss off no 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 right through the power of oh you again you're hungry can you eat some bastard mm, yes go nuts mm -hmm. Through the power of editing, the dragon came back and had a big fireball boosh! It destroyed the kingdom behind it. And the dragon came to my window and he took all of my gold. But I was unwilling to let it go. So I grabbed the sword of demon slaying and instead of killing the dragon, I realized it'd be easier to slit my own wrists and neck and fall out of the window to my doom and then with that king spammels was no more how's that for an ending and on that bombshell thank you for watching rate comment and subscribe and i'll see you in the next episode goodbye everybody Hehehehe <laughs>